Assalamu alaikum. In the previous video, I talked about uh, vowel harmony in Turkish, and I said that the high vowel of a suffix agrees in backness and rounding with the same vowel. Now we are going to move to a to another uh, harmony, it's a rounding harmony in the same language, which is Turkish. And this is the examples that we have to, that we have to work on in order to understand this rounding harmony. We have this is nomin nominal singular or nominative singular, genitive singular, nominative plural, and genitive plural. have jizin and we have jiz jizlor and we have here jiz jizlorin the rule says that the suffix vowel must agree in rounding with the steam vowel. Here we have this vowel, as we said, it's a high front round vowel. It agrees with the steam vowel in rounding because they are the same vowel. So in this example, we are talking about rounding harmony, but it's in nominative singular and genitive singular. We are talking about a rounding harmony in genitive, in genitive singular but in nominative plural we are not talking here about about rounding harmony because this one which is the suffix vowel or the suffix vowel does not agree with the steam vowel that's why we have in genitive plural we add an in to the suffix vowel and which is in this vowel it's a high vowel and it's unround vowel so it agrees with the mid vowel which is unround suffix vowel, vowel must be high and it should have the same feature of the of the suffix vowel here in in the singular form in singular form in singular in singular form the suffix vowel agrees to the same vowel but in genitive form the suffix or uh, genitive vowel agrees with the suffix vowel not the same vowel another example which is Pull, pullun, we have puller, we have here pull. Pullering. In this example, in genitive singular, the suffix vowel agrees in rounding with the steam vowel. In this case, we are going to talk about, or we are talking about, rounding a harmony. Here in, in genitive plural, This vowel agrees in rounding with the, with the suffix vowel and not with, the, with the, uh, the steam vowel. Here, this vowel is a high front and round, and this one in the suffix is, is low back and round. Sorry, this one is a high back. And round and this one is low back and round in this example in these examples you have to look just at the suffix or this one in genitive 
explorer we have you have to look about you have to look as i said in the in singular form genitive vowel agrees in rounding with the stem vowel but in the plural form genitive vowel agrees in rounding with the stem or with the suffix with the suffix vowel and not with the stem remember it if you have an example like this and it's about rounding harmony if in the in singular form you have to go and look for the vowel of the suffix vowel of a genitive form and compare it with with the stem the vowel of the stem but if if the, you have the plural form you have to look for the genitive vowel and compare it with the, the suffix vowel.